And Happy New Year. It's finally 2024. It's here. It's finally happening. We can say next year. We are getting Grand Theft Auto 6. Hell yeah. That's all I got to say about that, okay? Unless Rockstar delays it, which then, crap. But we are finally getting Grand Theft Auto 6 next year. We can finally say that. That sounds surreal. Like... It's hard to believe, right? So let me know in the comments down below what you guys did last night for New Year's Eve. Did you have fun? Have a party? I went to my grandfather's. We had an amazing time. We do a cookout every year. Super fun. And this channel, I plan on just making it explode this year. So please stick around, subscribe if you are new to my channel, and let's dive right in. So by the title of the video, you already know we're talking about the Florida Joker. He's the guy that was parodied in the GTA 6 trailer. Now, there was a lot of parodies going on in the GTA 6 trailer. Okay, lots of parodies. We have the Karen holding the, the hammers. We got the chick twerking on top of the car. The alligator getting pulled out of the pool. I mean, there's just a lot going on in the GTA 6 trailer. And this guy is just taking this in a whole extreme like he's getting a bunch of negative clout when he could use this for positive clout so the video that i'm going to show you is new it just dropped i don't know how long ago i was going to do a video on it but i've been in the process of moving and packing so it's been a little tedious doing videos uh, in the process of doing all of that especially when eventually i'm gonna have to pack up my computer and everything so stick around and you know, just you know stay tuned for new videos when i do upload them i'm this year it's gonna this month is going to be a little wonky but let's getting off track again, but he uploaded the video again, threatening Rockstar with his Jewish lawyers. I don't know why he's referring to his lawyers as Jewish. I think maybe he thinks that Rockstar is on the, uh, the whole war that's going on with Hamas and all that political stuff I don't want to get into. I feel like he, he thinks that Rockstar is on the opposite side of the Jewish people which makes no sense. Rockstar has no political views. They've never posted anything. Like, they've always made parodies of both sides. So it's, I don't know, I don't know what he's getting at with, with that. So if you have any idea, let me know in the comments down below. But let's go ahead and watch the video and we'll discuss it further. GTA, GTA, we gotta talk. GTA, we gotta talk. Y'all playing with my intelligence. It been mad days. This is a final... Warning, I just came back from Miami, just came back from California, talked to both my Jewish lawyers. We send you a letter. We are waiting for a response. If we don't get a response, by after my birthday, which is January 11, we're going to take legal actions. I want $5 million now, $5 million. I'm getting harassed everywhere I go, the airport, the streets, you that GTA joke. You that GTA Joker. What's good, GTA? Go talk to Take Two, your daddy. Rockstar, GTA, go talk to Take Two, your daddy, and get my money. Okay, so first off, he's referring to Rockstar as GTA. Like, GTA is not the company, it's Rockstar. He did, again, eventually later in the video, say Rockstar, GTA, and Take Two, which is the parent company of Rockstar Games. But he's just referring, and then he says, don't insult my intelligence. But he's referring to this company as GTA. GTA is the product that Rockstar is developing. So I don't know why he keeps referring to them as GTA. Maybe that's why Rockstar hasn't responded. They're like, uh, oh, we're not GTA, we're Rockstar. <laughs> so uh and and he's just he's saying that he's get, getting harassed at like the airport and places like that. Oh, you're the guy from the GTA 6 trailer, you're the GTA Joker. Okay. Probably because you're getting a bunch of negative clout because you're threatening Rockstar with a lawsuit and now demanding $5 million from them. If he used this as to gain positive clout, like if, if he was positive about it, like, hey, Rockstar used my likeness, that's pretty damn cool. People would probably want to take pictures with him. You know, if I saw him out in public and he was trying to be positive about all of this, I'd be like, hey, let me get a picture with you. Like, you're the guy from the GTA 6 trailer. That's pretty cool. It blows my mind that he's trying to do this, and he's giving them until January 11th, which is his birthday, which is a couple of days before my birthday. So he's got, I guess Rockstar Games has 11 days before uh, they get sued. So let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments down below. Do you think this guy has a chance at suing Rockstar and getting any sort of compensation? Like, it's just not going to happen, in my opinion. So... 
Again, let me know in those comments down below. Be sure to drop a like and subscribe. Let's make 2024 great. I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Bye. Have a beautiful time.